Meet the Readiness and Emergency Management for Schools, REMS Technical Assistance, TA Center, your national school safety center. Our mission is to help schools, school districts, and institutions of higher education increase their capacity to conduct prevention, protection, mitigation, response, and recovery activities around the variety of threats and hazards that they may face. Under the administration of the U.S. Department of Education's Office of Safe and Supportive Schools, and in collaboration with our local, state, national, and federal partners, we use a fourfold approach to carry out our mission to support school and campus safety, security, emergency management, and preparedness. Consider our site your go-to centralized hub to access free school and campus safety, security, emergency management, and preparedness tools, trainings, and resources from us and our federal partners. Now that you know a little about the REMS TA Center, this tutorial will help to prepare you to attend a REMS TA Center on-site training by request. If you are viewing this tutorial, you are likely already registered to attend an Addressing and Preventing Adult Sexual Misconduct training hosted by a local education agency in your community. The goal of this tutorial is to provide you with information on preparing to attend the training event, including assessing the required training materials to help ensure you gain the most benefit from the information presented on site. Let's get started. This day-long learning opportunity for schools and school districts is based on a training guide for administrators and educators on addressing adult sexual misconduct in the school setting also known as the ASM Guide. The ASM Guide was developed to provide guidance to safeguard the well-being of the whole community. This training is designed to help you develop a greater understanding of ASM in schools, understand the complexities of ASM, Learn how to develop comprehensive policies and procedures for preventing and addressing ASM in schools and school districts, and better protect students. The modules within this training are designed to help support school and school district administrators as they work to provide staff members with comprehensive ASM policies, procedures, and prevention measures, and training opportunities knowledge of the behaviors that constitute ASM and help them take steps to protect students. An ability to define, understand, recognize the signs and the impact of potential ASM and report and investigate possible ASM incidents with their partners, for example, law enforcement. Meaningfully respond to incidents of ASM using psychological first aid so that your schools may provide immediate, short-term, and long-term supports to the victim as the child recovers. You will also learn about tools and resources for ASM preparedness, along with some specialized topics such as prevention strategies, guidance for identifying and reporting ASM, such as the use of social media and technology in ASM. You will have the opportunity to apply what you have learned in interactive discussions. When you registered for this training, you should have received a registration confirmation with the information on assessing the training materials online. The main resource you will refer to in the training is the participant workbook. You will also be able to download a copy of the ASM guide, which will be referenced in the training. We will briefly go over these materials so you are prepared to get the most out of your training day. The participant workbook includes presentation slides which are helpful to have on hand during the training day. You can view them virtually by bringing along a laptop or tablet device with the downloaded materials or in hard copy by printing them out ahead of time. The participant workbook also includes a resource list which provides descriptions and links to tools and resources on ASM and other topics related to ASM such as youth safety education, hiring practices, and reporting and allegations. Before attending the training, we encourage you to view the REMS TA Center's archived webinar on addressing adult sexual misconduct in the school setting and overview, which summarizes the information you will learn in more detail at the training. 
Presenters in this webinar discuss ASM in schools and how education agencies can address this issue through the framework of their Emergency Operations Plan, or ELP. After viewing the webinar, please make note of at least two aspects of ASM you would like to learn more about or unanswered questions you have on the topic. If they are not addressed within the training, we invite you to request information on these topics during the training's open discussion. To view this webinar, visit the Training tab at rems.ed.gov, then select Webinars. Type ASM into the search bar available on the page, then scroll down to view the webinar and to download the corresponding presentation. Before attending the training, we also encourage you to learn more about your school or school district's existing ASM policies. This knowledge will help in the training's guided discussion and may help you identify questions ahead of time that you would like to ask the instructors during the training. You should read through the processes and policies you already have in place, identify two or three of the ASM guide's key concepts or principles, and list three things you hope to learn more about in the training. Again, bring this list to the training and ask the instructor about the concepts if they are not addressed on the day. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact the REMS TA Center's help desk by email at info at remstacenter.org or by toll-free telephone at 1-855-781-REMS or 7367 during regular business hours Eastern Time. We appreciate your time and your dedication to the important topic of school emergency preparedness and wish you all the best for a productive and enriching training. This concludes our tutorial for today. Thank you so much for watching.